good news in this time of pandemic. Recently, the story of Francisco Lopez, a street dweller, became viral in social media. Early in the morning, he went to a nearby Paris church not to ask for money or relief goods. Instead, he did an unexpected act of kindness. He gave an amount of 3,000 pesos to his parish priest that he received from generous people. Friends, what is the content of our prayer? How do we pray? Do we just come to God in prayer when there is something that we need or where there is pandemic? I hope not. Our prayer should become a habit of our lives. What is then the key to an authentic prayer life? Our right disposition in prayer should be like the story of Francisco, who is not afraid of surrendering everything that he had so that others may live. Remember that when we pray, we are beggars before the Lord. We should humbly submit ourselves before this great God who is rich in patience and kindness. According to John of the Cross, when we pray, we should be naked from any preoccupation of this world. While the rest of Jesus puts it this way, that we should always have an enough knowledge of ourselves, acknowledging our poverty and misery, who is in need of God's mercy and love. So let us pray. Lord, unite us always in the poverty of the poor, knowing that only you can satisfy all our longings.